Afternoon peeps, how are we all doing? Wasn't actually planning on filming today. I was just out doing some food delivery. I was just gonna have a normal sort of day shift. And then I went on Amazon Flex, just out of curiosity to see if with the new year, the blocks had started to die down and just wanted to see what was on there, curious. And uh, there were like 12 offers throughout the rest of the day, all been boosted to like 26 pounds an hour. So I thought, well, I'll be picking up this banger then, won't I? 91 quid, three and a half hours, bit of a spontaneous Amazon Flex block. And after the last slight disaster of a route, I thought, yeah, let's, uh, let's give it another go. Because even if I get a route like that again, for 91 quid, it might actually be worth it. Right, let's go load up. Oh, folks, I cannot believe my luck. It's like somebody at Amazon saw my last Amazon Flex video and they thought, come on, mate, don't be disheartened. Amazon Flex can be great sometimes. Because just then, when I scanned my trolley to see where I was going, I saw that I'd been given a two hour route on a three and a half slot. So we're getting paid 91 pounds to deliver for two hours. And on top of that, it's in Tiverton and it's actually in the town. We're gonna to be on normal roads delivering to normal addresses. I could not be happier. This is exactly what I meant when I said this job is like a slot machine. You have no idea what you're gonna get. But all I know right now is before expenses, which aren't gonna be much, I'm getting paid over 45 pounds an hour. Honestly, I feel like I've won the lottery. I do have quite a lot of parcels in the car and they're sort of falling around everywhere at the minute, but that's fine. The route itself is so dense. I think from, from what I can remember, you'll see it on the screen, but it's like, it's just within a few roads. So I don't think there's gonna be a lot of driving on this route once we get to our first drop. We're pretty much just gonna be dropping off parcels with the odd little bit of moving the car a few yards. It's gonna be quite a few stops with multiple deliveries, but that's absolutely fine. Because at the end of the day, no matter how many parcels I've got, this is a two hour route on a three and a half hour slot. I am so glad I took the gamble today. So glad. You can't ask for more really, can you? A really nice boosted rate for a block and then you go and pick your parcels up and you get given a route that's like half the length that you were booked in for. I can already tell you this is gonna be the best paying Amazon Flex block I've ever done. Right, we are just heading up onto the M5 now to get ourselves up to Tiverton. Let's get some tunes going and I'll see you at drop number one. Here's our junction and we are one mile, three minutes from our first drop. I don't think this video is going to be very long. It doesn't look like I'm going to be in the car very much and it's only a two hour route. But still, I'll take you for the ride with me and ultimately this is all about what my profit is after expenses. Ooh, Mackie D's. Nope, I'm not allowed. I'm on a diet. Right, looks like we're just around the corner from drop number one. Let's get it. Oh yeah. This is more like where I like doing deliveries. Quiet residential areas, Mwah. can't go wrong on a route like this. Anyone in? There's some lights on. Just put this in a safe place, in the dry. That'd be jubbly. Next drop, literally around the corner. This is the only problem, I'm trying to find the damn parcels. No, not that one. Oh no. <laughs> They're different addresses. I'm a plonker. Should go through. Lovely job. And now I just need to find, there's one. Just need the other one from the second address. I definitely saw it. Oh yeah. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Right, got that one done. Again, around the corner to the next one. This annoys me. What does that say? Envelope. That is not an envelope, Amazon. Wasting my time looking through all my envelopes, not finding it. Yeah, right. Oh, lovely. Thank Thanks you. Thanks a lot. Cheers. A bit of a theme here. 
just around the corner to the next one. But we are delivering five parcels, but that's good. You can empty the car a little bit. So these five parcels are to a few different addresses, but literally all of these. That's me. Lovely, all good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, all right. Do you want me to chuck them down yes, there? Yes, please. <laughs> oh, let's grab a quick uh, picture as well. That's all right. all right. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Cheers. Take care. Done. Now just two more at this stop. I know where the other that is. It's that one and an envelope. Let's hope this one actually is an envelope, Amazon. Yes. We're in luck. Safe place down there, I think. Gonna have to be done. Sorted. Five parcels lighter. Medium box. Thing is, what's what's medium? Is that medium? That's medium, apparently. Good to know. Doesn't look like anyone's in. Never know. Aha! A light. Oh yeah, all right. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you very much. Easy. Right, you can now join me on my drive to my next drop. And we're here. I love routes like this. Lights on in there. I'm gonna have to find someone to leave this. Ah, oh, there's nowhere. I'm gonna have to try this one again in a minute. I can't leave that in the pissing rain. It's not fair, is it? I wasn't expecting the rain to be this heavy. What do I always say? Don't trust the weather forecast in this country because it's never right. And they look like parcel boxes. Are these parcel boxes or are they recycled? Right. Can't deliver those either. Brilliant. All right, so slightly annoying. Wasn't able to deliver to either of those addresses as there's nowhere safe to leave the parcels. It's pissing down with rain and the customer isn't in. So I will try again later because the beauty of routes like this, you're never too far away to give it another go. And in this case, that is going to be a lot easier than going back to the depot and a lot quicker. Oh, a useless door knocker. Are you going to make any noise with that flimsy little bit of metal? Oh yeah, all right. Okay. Yeah, is that all right? Thank Thanks a lot. Take care. Oh, yeah, all right. That's great. Thank you. Yeah, we're literally driving nowhere on this route. Cool. Look how close I got there. This one is a small box. That's the one. I've requested to use the doorbell. Oh, yeah, all right. Thank you. I really hope I can re-deliver these later. I don't want to have to go back to the depot. Can't complain too much though, even if I have to go. Not like I've been given a, a difficult route, is it? Envelope for this one. That's fine, mate. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Right. Uh, Cheers. This next one's going to those flats. Hi. Hi. Thanks Hi. a lot. Ta. Oh, don't you hate it when it does this? I'm here, I'm in the right delivery area. I think, there we go. <laughs> I've just come out the back, but my sense of direction is so bad. Well, we're almost halfway through the route. It's slowed down a little bit by the rain, but hopefully as long as we can get those undelivered parcels delivered at the end of the route, it should be a killer. Oh, <laughs> at least it stopped raining now. Another box. This is probably the longest drive I've had this route. It was about 500 feet. That's this one up here, isn't it? It's the one. Oh yeah, all right. All right thank you. Just got a picture of that one. Oh, you all yours, sir? Thank you, Thank you very much. Right, we're getting through these a bit quicker now. Literally up the road, there's no point in me even driving to that one. Going in. They have said behind the wheelie bin. 
and this one can go through the leather box. Done. Get rid of this big boy. Oh. Oh yeah, all right. Got it. Thanks Cheers, buddy. Thanks. Here's the next one. Just down here. Hey, all right. Thank you. Thank Cheers. you. Uh, blocking another car in. <coughs> cool on this road. Four parcels at numbers 51, 47, and 57. These routes are so easy. I haven't even had time to put the put my podcast on. No point. I see a light. Hey, all right. Thank you. So this entire route has been this quiet housing estate. Can't ask for more than that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And you. Right, next up, 57 and 32. Back up the road a little bit. Yeah, all right. Thank you. Thanks a lot, sorry. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Oh, yeah, Thank right. you. Thanks, bud. We're now on stop number 17 of 24. <laughs> we're, we're nearly done. Just need to remember that I do have three parcels to reattempt for two addresses, but they're next door neighbours, so I'm wondering, even if they're not in, when I try again, I'm just going to find another neighbour and try and leave it with them. Because where I am right now is about halfway between my house and the depot, so I don't really want to have to go back to the depot and then back, even more distance back to my house. Even though, like I've said, the pay for this, the pay for this route is insane. So it would be worth whatever I needed to do. But still, I'm going to want to maximise it, aren't I? Yeah, all right. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Yeah, guys, I am sorry that this video is going to be so boring. This isn't exactly the kind of route that makes for tantalising viewing, I'm aware. But I've got to share with you just my sheer success in getting a route that pays amazing. It's finally happened. You hear all these stories about people getting these kind of routes. And it finally happened to me. Six stops left. Roots like this every time, please, Amazon. Oh, yeah, all right. Thank you very much. That's all right. Have a good evening. Thanks. All right, so we'll get this one done. And then I've got one stop left, but I think I need to retry the other ones. I need to retry those two from earlier before I complete the last stop. Otherwise, my route will complete, I think. But I've just checked, and it's literally two minutes down that way. So it's quicker for me to just go back to those old stops and then come back up this way for the last one. And I'm hoping now they'll be in. It's just gone half past five. Hello. Oh yeah, it's Amazon. Yeah, can you just leave it to the, just down in that, behind that bush on the right Yeah, no worries, mate. I'll chuck it there now. I think that's the second time ever I've been spoken to through a ring doorbell. Oh, see my last customer is just there, but we're gonna need to go back and retry these. There's no point in even ringing them, I'm just going to head back and we'll try and find a neighbour if we need to. But yeah, literally my last stop is so close to that house I just delivered to, but I'm worried if I complete the route it won't let me come and try these again. Because this has never happened to me before where I've wanted to actually retry a delivery. And to my knowledge, when you swipe complete on that last stop, it immediately pops up with the uh, you've got parcels to return dialogue thingy so but yeah god this entire route in one housing estate it has actually taken me slightly longer than two hours looking more like two hours and 15 but to be honest and probably put that down to my lack of organizing the parcels and the rain slowing me down a little bit here we are let's reattempt these deliveries and if no one's in again the neighbor it is Oh yeah, I was just checking you were in. Like, have you just got back? Yeah. Yeah, I called I for you earlier. No, that's all right. Yeah, I've got two for number five as well. Are you all right to have them? Amazing, thank you. I'll just grab a knife. Oh, result. She's in. And those two. Neighbor. I'll just grab your first name. Excellent. Oh, do you mind just scribbling on there? It does this sometimes, no, right. randomly ask for a signature. 
Perfect, that's a lifesaver because now I don't have to go back to the depot. No, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, bye. Ah, results. Right, let's get these two to the last stop and we're done. See, I'm telling you, always worth retrying deliveries if uh, they're not too far away from the rest of your route or from where your route's taking you. That's going to save me about 50 miles if I include my drive home as well because I'd have to go south back to the depot and then north back home. Whereas now I can just do the final little bit north to get home. Job done. Obviously for the numbers at the end of this video, we will uh, take a drive back to the depot into account because that's what we do for all of our Amazon blocks. But for me personally, I don't have to go back there and I'm just going home because this is one hell of a miserable evening. But yeah, I mean, this goes to show the, the variety that you get with Amazon Flex, especially in Devon. Right, I think we're here. Hey, all right. Cheers, Cheers, bud. Pitch black. Should have brought my head torch. <laughs> oh, nearly slipped. This is the real number, so it's freezing parcels in the black box on the pad here. But you don't know. That's it, finished. Took us closer to two and a half hours, but obviously on my three and a half block, that's a win. All right guys, we're done. I've run the numbers. I've added on the time and the distance back to the depot, even though we're not going back there. Keep our earnings rundowns consistent. That's obviously what we do. So it took me two and a half hours, but it's about half an hour from here back to the depot. So three hours altogether for this route. Six pounds 90 in fuel. Again, if I was going back to the depot, £1.50 on insurance, that's £82.60 profit. Divide that by three, that's £27.53 an hour. And for me, I made even more than that because I'm not driving back to the depot. So happy days, love it when Amazon Flex is like this. When you get lucky, you book a 3.5 hour route that's already boosted massively. You only get given a two hour block. Okay, the block actually took me two and a half because I was slowed down a bit, but it just goes to show how much this job can vary. Compared to the last route I did that you saw in my previous Amazon Flex video, this was an absolute dream. Guys, thanks for joining me again. It's been a pleasure and I will see you in the next video. Peace.